The changing face of crime puts officers in dangerous and even life-threatening situations, so protective wear is a critical part of modern policing. Aegis Engineering, part of the Safari Land Group, is using innovative technologies to design advanced protective wear and equipment that can save an officer's life. Today's officers face ever-changing challenges, terrorism, loan shooters and riots. We're at the Met's Specialist Training Centre. The officers here are learning to deal with life-threatening situations, so they need to be protected. Responding to an incident in 2013, PC Adam Koch was stabbed repeatedly by a man wielding a black commando knife. I looked down and I could see blood coming out from under my vest and I, I peeled my vest back and saw I think it was my stomach coming out through my t-shirt and uh, at that point I, I sort of just killed over really. He was saved by his protective vest. There were five or six uh, wounds to the back of the vest, most of which were sort of over my spine and I'm told from the, the, the examination that one of them went three quarters of the way through the vest over my spine. I've got no doubt that the vest saved my life. His body armour was designed by Aegis Engineering based in the UK. The company was recently acquired by the Safari Line Group, a globally recognised designer and manufacturer of personal protective equipment, including ballistic helmets, shields, rifle plates, body-worn cameras and bomb suits. It's the collaborations of the, their experience within the US. That's a market dominated by ballistic threats. We have a lot of experience in STAB and we can harness both entities. I think going forward, you're going to see the equipment fully integrated with cameras, sensors, and GPS. I think the officer is going to be connected real time. The command center is going to be able to see what the officer is doing. Innovation is the key, when in the thick of the action, officers need to be agile. So they've designed a body armor 30% lighter. The new anatomical plates that are in service um, with UK police forces, um, again, these are a lot lighter than the officers have seen before. It's a lot better for them in terms of mobility, and less burdensome, and uh, therefore they can focus on other things other than being uh, tired and hot. Being part of the Safari Line Group means Aegis is part of a legacy that sole mission is to save lives. Officer Jared Reston was shot seven times trying to apprehend a shoplifter. I took seven shots, one through my chin here, Exited out, that bullet then struck my chest. I took one dead center of my chest and my trauma plate. Took one through my left thigh, just above the knee. His body plate took the full force of a potentially fatal hit. He's now a member of the Safari Line Group's Saves Club. It honors officers saved by their armor. They become advocates in reinforcing the importance of being protected so they come home to their families. Body armor is such a force multiplier, it, you know, it works in car crashes, it works in ballistic attacks, stabbings, just regular even physical fights. If someone hits your body, it doesn't hurt because it's all absorbed in the armor. It makes you, the weapon system, more invincible and just staying in it. It just keeps you in the fight. Safari Land's body armor has saved nearly 2,000 lives. And as the group expands internationally, so does its ethos. PC Adam Koch is the UK's first save officer. I'm really an advocate for the importance of wearing our, our kit and, and, and ma maintaining the quality and, 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 and wanting to have the best kit available to do our job to, to make sure we all come home and we stay safe and sound. Our mission is together we save lives and so far we've saved 1974 lives. We sent police officers home to be with their families and have dinner and that's a pretty good feeling. We have a dedicated wall inside all of our facilities that's called the Saves Wall. Uh, a light goes off and there's bells that are rung, everybody knows that's a save. They move over to that wall and the save story is read to all of our employees at the same time. There's cheers, everybody understands that what we do counts and it matters, and an officer is alive because of the work that we do.